Welcome to the We On podcast, where we explore fascinating stories and ideas from various fields. In this episode, we explore a hint of life in the universe as NASA makes a breakthrough discovery of a carbon molecule in space. Found using the James Webb Telescope, this tiny molecule could be a key building block for life beyond Earth. The breakthrough discovery of carbon molecules was made by NASA's James Webb Space Telescope. A team of international scientists has used NASA's James Webb Telescope to detect a new carbon compound in space for the first time. Known as methyl cation, or CH3+, the molecule is important because it aids the formation of more complex carbon-based molecules. It was detected in a young star system with a protoplanetary disk, known as D203506, which is located about 1,350 light-years away in the Orion Nebula, stated NASA in its latest website post. The space agency added that carbon compounds exist in the foundations of all known life, and their discovery is particularly interesting for scientists who are working to understand how life developed on Earth and how it can exist in some other part of the universe. The study of interstellar organic chemistry, which Webb is opening in new ways, is an area of keen fascination to many astronomers, stated NASA. Explaining the role of the James Webb Telescope in the discovery of carbon molecules, NASA stated, The unique capabilities of Webb made it an ideal observatory to search for this crucial molecule. Webb's exquisite spatial and spectral resolution, as well as its sensitivity, all contributed to the team's success. In particular, Webb's detection of a series of key emission lines from CH3 Plus cemented the discovery. Marie-Aline Martin-Drumel, who is a professor at the University of Paris-Saclay in France and a member of the science team, stated that this discovery not only validates Webb's incredible sensitivity, but also emphasizes the postulated central importance of CH3 plus in interstellar chemistry. While the star in Proplid is a small red dwarf, the system is bombarded by strong ultraviolet or UV light from nearby hot, young, massive stars. Scientists believe that most planet-forming disks go through a period of such intense UV radiation since stars tend to form in groups that often include massive UV-producing stars, NASA stated. NASA said that generally complex organic molecules are destroyed by UV radiation, and hence the discovery of CH3 plus is a big achievement. However, the team predicts that UV radiation might actually provide the necessary source of energy for CH3 plus to form in the first place. Once formed, it then promotes additional chemical reactions to build more complex carbon molecules. Broadly, the team notes that the molecules they see in Proplide are quite different from typical protoplanetary disks. In particular, they could not detect any signs of water, stated NASA. Thanks for tuning into this incredible story. If this episode resonated with you, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more captivating stories to come. Stay tuned.